Welcome to Physiomatics. In this video, we will discuss foods that can increase the risk of diabetes. Type 2 diabetes is one of the most common diseases Americans live with. The latest figures shows that 11% of the population has type 2 diabetes and an additional 96 million American adults have prediabetes, according to the American Diabetes Association. Although some people are at a higher risk of developing type 2 diabetes due to uncontrollable factors such as genetics and family history, it's important to do your part through diet and exercise. While there isn't a magic food to prevent diabetes, eating the right combination of healthy carbohydrates, fats, and proteins can help you in the long run. How does food play a role in diabetes? The words blood sugar in relation to diabetes can be confusing to some. Eating foods that taste sweet or consuming too much sugar isn't the only way to get diabetes. It's much more involved than that. To understand why type 2 diabetes occurs, you need to understand the role of glucose and how your body processes carbohydrate. Carbs, which serve as an important macronutrient along with fats and proteins, contain sugars, starch, and fibers. After eating a meal, your body processes carbs into glucose to provide energy to cells. The glucose enters your bloodstream and causes your blood sugar to rise. To help offset this rise, the pancreas releases insulin, a hormone that allows glucose to enter cells. Chronic levels of high blood sugar from eating certain foods can alter your body's ability to use insulin properly, leading to type 2 diabetes. Foods with sugar, such as deserts, soft drinks, candy, can all quickly raise your blood sugar, but so can starchy foods. For example, a stack of pancakes loaded with refined carbohydrate is high on the glycemic index or the time it takes to increase glucose levels. That may be an obvious case. White potatoes are an example of a less unassuming food. Your body processes the starches in white potatoes quickly, leading to a spike in blood sugar. Which types of food can cause diabetes? Carbs are only part of the equation when it comes to an increased risk of type 2 diabetes. In general, any food that can lead to weight gain puts you at risk of developing diabetes. Here are some of the most common foods to stay away from or eat in moderation. Number 1. Refined Carbohydrates Many foods contain refined flour that removes the bran and the germ during processing. The finished product doesn't have nearly the same dietary fiber as whole grains. As a result, the body processes these starches quickly, leading to glucose spikes. Examples of refined carbohydrates include white bread, white rice, white pasta, pizza, chips and crackers. Diets rich in refined carbs have been linked to an increased risk of developing type 2 diabetes. Number 2. Foods high in saturated fats. You may not associate saturated fats with diabetes, but this unhealthy dietary fat has been linked to insulin resistance. Plus, eating any foods that can lead to weight gain can also put you at risk. Foods with saturated fat include fatty cuts of red meat, skin on chicken or poultry, coconut and palm oil, and full-fat dairy products such as butter, cheese, and milk. Number 3. Foods with added sugar Any foods with added sugar, especially fructose, cause glucose level to rapidly spike. Added sugars include obvious sweets such as candy, cakes, cookies, and ice cream, and less obvious examples such as yogurt, sauces, and salad dressings. Number 4. Sugary drinks. Whether it's a lemon lime soda or a juice box, sugary drinks are full of empty calories with no nutritional benefits. In other words, in other words, this is a quick way to spike your blood sugar. A single 12 ounce soft drink has about 40 grams of added sugar or 10 teaspoons. Similarly, a 12 ounce serving of fruit punch has 26 grams of added sugar or more than 6 teaspoons of sugar. One study found a single sugary beverage consumed each day can increase the risk of type 2 diabetes by 25%. Number 5. Fried Foods Foods fried in fatty oils can lead to weight gain, high cholesterol, and high blood pressure. A study found eating fried foods 4 to 6 times per week increased the risk of type 2 diabetes by 39%. 
that number jumped to 55 percent for people who ate fried foods every day number six processed foods processed food are a way for food manufacturers to add oils sugars salt and preservatives to increase product flavor and shelf life the end result is foods high in sugar calories and sometimes saturated fat conversely they are also low in nutrition and fiber number seven foods with trans fat trans fats are another type of bad fat that can lead to cardiovascular problems that in turn increase your risk of diabetes while trans fats have largely been removed from products they can still show up in foods despite labels reading zero grams trans fat by law foods can contain up to 0.5 grams of trans fat per serving and still be labeled at zero grams check food packaging for partially hydrogenated oil this may appear in margarine snack foods and packaged baked foods